This is a CBS 4 News update. I'm Jim Barry. We begin with the latest on the coronavirus pandemic. Late last night, the Senate passed a $2 trillion stimulus package that will inject money back into the economy. The stimulus package now heads to the House for its approval. If they say yes, people could be receiving $1,200 cash payments, student loans would be suspended through September, and small businesses could qualify for loans, which could convert to grants. Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell told NBC News we may already be in a recession, but he says the recovery will likely be quick. And now the latest number of COVID-19 cases in Florida. There are now more than 2,300 cases statewide. Miami-Dade County has the most with 616. Broward County follows with 504. And so far, 28 people have died in the state. President Trump is as popular right now as he has ever been. In New Gallup poll, 49% approve of the job the president is doing, which is up 5% from earlier this month. And when it comes to how President Trump is handling the coronavirus crisis, his numbers are even better. 60% of Americans polled say they approve. That's our news for now. You can always find us on CBSMommy.com and tune into CBS 4 News at 5, 6, 7, and 11 for all of today's important headlines.